It's strategy. And then she's like uh, trying to run away. But then a shot of sniper rifle stops her. Looking at one of the other rooftops, you see that there is actually there is actually Rio standing on one of these rooftops, and he shot like at uh, at Millie with a sniper to stop her, and he shoots like at her leg, and then she's like, and then she falls down, and it's like you're not going anywhere, and then you see Doggy Oak. Like uh, jumping in, and it's like, that's right, woof. <laughs> <laughs> and then he just jumps on one of the guys and starts like eating him. Whoa. Okay, it's your turn again. What you gonna do, guys? Now it's gonna be four of you and then four of me. Yeah, who should start? I think Marcus, you should your you have like more enemies around. Hmm. All right. Let's see. Um. Yeah. What I would do is like walk around this one, and then use an energy ray. To get those two which are in front of me now. Okay, please launch the energy ray. I have a two again. Okay, so the first uh, one does two, so he rolls again. I did six, roll again. Okay. Six. Okay, roll again. <laughs> I did Five. three. Okay, so you hit the first one and uh, the second one uh, yeah. avoids because you did two okay. originally. Okay. Yeah. So uh, this guy is like, oh, dice. Uh, <laughs> I need to do up my rolling a bit because <laughs> always rolling two is is not gonna help. <laughs> no, 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 not in this session at least. Mm -hmm. All right. Okay. What else? Because uh, you have three more actions. Mm hmm. Um. Second, I need to keep keep uh, keep remembering like writing down how many mana I have left because otherwise I forget about it. So um, yeah, the one that is not hit gets an energy ball. Hopefully okay. hitting this time. So you energy ball him. It's like it's gonna with one end and then with the other end. Bam. Okay. How much do you do? Four. I did four as well. Roll again. Three. Okay, I did two. And then the guy's like, <laughs> when he explodes. All right. So, um, yeah, there is one in front of Red Rails. With my last action, I will try to shoot him. Okay. I have a three. I did a six. All right, then. And the guy's just a voice and just jumps behind you. You see that uh, he's the smartest one of them all. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I cannot move. Why can I? I want him so bad. I'm... Oh. What's going on? Why am I multiplying things here? Yo. Okay. <laughs> that guy was persistent. <laughs> I thought he was the strongest one. <laughs> <laughs> and then uh, you see that behind you, Ria is like. These guys don't have any chance. <laughs> he shoots, and then there is like a guy on the window, which was the other sniper, that just gets shot in the head, and then he dies. <laughs> oh. Focus. Camera. Hmm. Okay, who's next? All right, fire, fix the camera. Me. Okay, <laughs> go on. The, the, your, okay, helicopter, uh, your helicopter is falling down. It's like it's falling down. Yeah. Okay. Um. Let's say is near to the roof of one of the buildings. <clears throat> yeah, it's kind of it's kind of going to fall in this building over here. 
Okay. Um, from the sky before uh, crashing, I try to aim and throw the plasma torch uh, turn on uh, on the on the guy uh, that stands on the roof. Like from the helicopter, I want to uh, throw the plasma torch or <laughs> let let plasma torch fall because we are kind of uh, <laughs> over him. It oh. was an accident. Okay, okay. Please give me a roll. You're gonna have a plus two for the rule of cinema. Okay. I did one. Okay, you're gonna hit one. I did one. <laughs> okay. No, we have the plus two. So you just go yeah, there yeah, and you hit the plasma torch, and it's like, okay, this is time. Say goodbye, Rio. And then he sees like a plasma torch falling in his face, like, what the fuck? <laughs> <laughs> it's like, ah, burning. <laughs> and then he starts shooting Woo! in the air. It, it's not dead, but uh, it's KO, basically. Well, okay. And then the, the helicopter, but... you realize, is about to crash over the drills. Well, th this, is, uh, this is also kind of a problem. Uh... Sure. Is there anything that I can do uh, trying to pilot the helicopter, or it's just uh, it's no? The... That, that you can try to save the pilot if you want. Uh yeah. Uh, then I will try to save the pilot. I want to grab the pilot, and uh, what the fuck I can do now? <laughs> <laughs> and. Uh... Uh, is there a, a, a ladder the, on the helicopter? I mean, you could try, yes. What do you want to do with the ladder, though? Uh, good question. <laughs> <laughs> you can raise the ladder, yes, if you want. Okay. <laughs> I try to de-escalate the ladder uh, while the uh, helicopter is falling down, just to jump from a lower uh, like. You can't because the helicopter is like going spinning around on itself. Fuck. Okay. Yeah. That. That's what I thought. Eli, I told you to jump. Why are you still there? And, um... then, and then you see like Eli. It's just insulting you, but uh, you don't Why? understand the words. <laughs> Why is he going to speak? You. It was as easy and doing this. She is watching at me. No. That I want to jump from the helicopter. Okay, uh, you are uh, pretty much at this height right now, about to crash okay. in the trails. Um, okay, yeah, red rails is a nice spot to fall in. <laughs> <laughs> Be my guest. <laughs> uh, I'm grabbing the pilot wow. and I, I jump uh, over that place. Okay, you manage to jump and then there is like a pilot. Okay, please give me a roll. I'm gonna set up the difficulty of a force I did one, okay. You go, you're gonna jump outside of the helicopter and you fall down on a pile of snow and the helicopter Ooh. is about to arrive on your face, Redreus. So you realize that the part which is spinning is going mm. to divide you in two if you don't do something. I spread myself into a, a cloud of thunder machine. Okay. And then the helicopter passes through you and uh, crashes on the building next to, to the other crash that you just did. <laughs> <laughs> I see that everybody's perfectly good with landings in this party. Um, all right. Millie, and then you see Doggy Oak jumping to the next victim. And then he's like, oh, oh. Doggy, stop Doggy. And it's like, too late. And then he starts like chopping on his balls and he's like, ah. <laughs> and, then and then it's gone. The other guy is fucking dead. You see that there is Rhea on the roof and he's uh, tinkering with something on his hand. What's your guys gonna do? You're no longer in initiative right now. <clears throat> um. Well, at first, I compose myself and uh, stand up and take if the pilot was right and let him run away. <clears throat> the pilot runs away and was like, I'm out of this shit. <laughs> <laughs> uh, 
And the, the other guy that survived just runs away as well. Like, fuck you, Millier, I'm, this is not worth my life. <laughs> um, hmm. I'm with Eli, right? Yes, you are with Eli, and she's tied. And in front of you, there is uh, this woman with the red cape standing in front of you. And she's looking at you. And she's silent. She's, you feel like that she's um, evaluating you. Okay, um, I approach to Eli and say, are you okay? Let me help you. As soon as you try to approach to Eli, you see that the girl takes away like uh, some kind of um, a, a stuff. And she opens it up and she smashes it on the gun. She's like the doom to, to tell you, to intimidate you to not get close. I would not do that, girl. I'm still evaluating if you are worth to live or worth to die. <clears throat> um, excuse me, what was your name again? I'm Nicole. Nicole, okay, Nicole. Uh, do you know who I am? <laughs> you are Yvette Marvarid, friend of uh, Polo. And you see that, uh, Yvette, give me awareness. A one plus plus, plus uh, okay you see that in one of the walls there is like uh, a picture of you covered in uh, what looks like red painting or blood you cannot tell and then it's like friend of volo written next to it oh no that picture of me is horrible i don't like red doesn't match my hair. Hmm. Um, I'm so sorry, but I think I will have to fight you. Because that... you are with my friend Eli. And you don't touch my friend. Do you know what your friend is saving right now? I don't care. Mm. To go with her. Oh, that's a shame. I really like you, Yvette. I don't want to kill you. Okay, so uh, let my friend go, and w everything will be fine, and you won't get hurt. <laughs> and then uh, she looks at you like, okay, all right, I will, I will go. Just let me. And she presses a button on uh, on her watch, <laughs> and you're like a bleep behind you. And then there is like uh, some kind of. Uh, stuff that opens up from the wall there's like a, um, a small box that opens up and then there is like a, a chain trying to grab you from behind to get you stuck Fuck. Uh, can i avoid, uh, avoid it with my sword no but you have to roll you have minus two sword? because you are surprised man i did a one <laughs> what we want today? <laughs> okay you, you get grabbed and you get stuck on the wall and she's like oh too bad she has the information i need so eli gets with me merry christmas yvette marvarid she grabs no, yvette like no. <laughs> and no. to run away. <laughs> fuck, fuck. <laughs> okay so i'm alone here in this room and then uh you see that uh e rio ignores everybody <coughs> And goes down to Millie. And it's like, where is, where are they? And Millie's like, fuck you, traitor. It's like, and Rio gets close to her and she just takes her up and it's like, it's like, wrong answer. And she punches her in the right. face and it's like, where is she? I'm not gonna ask again. What's your guys gonna do? <clears throat> um. Hey Emily, uh, have you heard about the Team Rocket? Cause you are kind of like them, always losing and always coming back again. Uh, why don't you just give what we want now, and we don't have to go through this? The Georg poops in, uh, into the one of the face of the enemies in the meantime. <laughs> <laughs> so, Rio, Rio is like, 
I don't like this interference. It's like you uh, give me awareness, Volo. Okay. Four. Do you notice that uh, Rio is not too pleasant of your presence here? Well, Rio, what? Also, what are you doing here? Long time to see you. It's a pleasure always. Asking you for the last time. Where did you bring them? And she's like, fuck you. If you want to find the elusive one so bad, <laughs> then you would have to find my box and only I know where it is. You want to save the elusive one? Well, you have to keep me alive. What's your guys gonna do? Well, I'm uh, trying to scream. <laughs> the top of my lungs with, with the hope that someone will hear me. Yeah. <laughs> I can do anything. Guys! Please, someone! <laughs> Ay, okay, I hate Christmas. And she's like, <laughs> oh, Rio. And then she's bleeding from her face. Like, you underestimate me. I gave the information to the little robot way before. It's just encrypted and she doesn't know. And then, uh, Adreus, Marcus, you both have a flashback on when you were on the vehicle coming here. And then you remember that uh, before arriving here, Eli had received a strange ping and uh, some kind of strange packet uh, that received via download from a local source coming from here. And she was trying to understand what that was, but she didn't manage to unpack it. What's you guys gonna do? Hmm, I mean, Eli is there, right? I mean, she's not on the map, but... Eli is being kidnapped right now. Still there. Yeah, but... Okay, so I don't... <laughs> but Do we know, know about that? that? No. We don't know that. You heard the scream of Yvette coming from the roof. It's like, ah! Yeah. Okay. Okay. Guys, please, oh. someone! Hi. Yvette, um... you, uh, your, uh, your communicator is kind of damaged. But you might be able to activate it again to communicate with the others. Ah, oh, okay. That would be uh, better <laughs> than screaming. <laughs> okay. I'm okay, so I try to uh, connect with them. Guys, hello? Can you hear me? I did it. Yeah, hello. We can hear you. Marcus, what's what's going on? Marcus, please, can you um help me? Because I'm uh, tied with chains in this building. So, can you come, please, or someone? Uh, okay, yeah, we, we heard you scream, yeah. I guess. And yeah. what did you do? <laughs> we, we, we were about to get to you. Okay. Don't worry. No worries, we're coming. Okay, thank you. And then it's like, okay, let's go save Yvette, shall we? I will just finish this trash. And Millie's like... <laughs> You need me. Only I can unpack that data. Seems like that you will have to carry me around. What a shame. And you're just like, damn it. All right. And then there is like, uh, knocks her out unconscious and gives him to her to Doggy Ox to carry around. Doggy Ox starts uh, transforming a little bit with nano machines. You remember he's made of nano machines. And uh, he becomes like a bigger version of himself. And he carries around uh, Millie. Becomes big, do big chunk doggy oak. Man, that's fucking cool. <laughs> <laughs> All right, let, let's let's go into the building, right? All right. How do you go to the building? The stairs are broken. Can I throw somebody by the window, maybe? Yeah, yeah you, you can just, there's a <laughs> hole there, but uh, you realize... Oh, I, can, I can fly there. I can fly there because I can fly. Yeah. Rio just uh, shoots a grappling hook and goes up. It's like, it's like 
Mm-hmm. And Doggy Oak has like some kind of uh, fly. She has some, some kind of like the same thing that Eli has that makes her fly just on her on her legs. I fly up as well. Yeah. I'm gonna I'm gonna call this version of Doggy or Chonky Oak. <laughs> <laughs> All right, you are all inside this place over here. Please move your characters. Mm-hmm. <laughs> and there did like my version of Tokyo. I'm going to send you a big plush so you can nag him. <laughs> I'm going to drink a mana potion. You see that there is like Yvette uh, being uh, uh, contained by some kind of metal claw. It's it's kind of it's kind of rustic. It's different. It's particular. Hi guys. It's, it's like a mage. Hello. <laughs> you need a hand? Yeah, maybe two. I I'm so sorry. I tried to save Eli, but I couldn't. Just... Okay. I'm so sorry. Okay, anyone who is very strong, or should we try with magic? I mean, do whatever you need I to do. Try. I mean, you, you know that I'm not very strong in terms of physical strength, so maybe you try it first. I can try to put my uh, katana in the chain and turn it to break it. Wait, be careful. <laughs> no, no, but like somewhere... I want to see that. Can... <laughs> I trust you, man. Trust you. Yeah. Oh. All right. So <laughs> you uh, you manage to you manage to break it. Yeah. No roll. <laughs> you. <laughs> Thank you, man. It's uh, this like this piece of metal. It's like it's it was like strong. If you were like from outside, but from from the outside, it was very easy. You realize it was like some kind of homemade trap. Everybody, give me awareness. Difficulty five. Hmm. One. Say... Four plus two, six. Four plus one, five. Okay. And uh, now I need you to roll for me. Uh, tinkering. Okay. Difficulty five, still. Three plus three, six. Two. One plus. Wow, I have nine. Three, four. Five Whoa. plus four, nine. Nine. Okay, so you realize first uh, that uh, while moving in this room, she's not here, <laughs> uh, and Eli is not here anymore. Uh, while moving in this room, you realize that there is like a careful planning on how to take down uh, the route that would have brought Volo to his location, and then she had eyes uh, inside the Magus all the time that you were preparing for this mission. Also, you realize that a lot of the stuff on the tools here, it's like full of like traps that she could have used against you, but she didn't because uh, they are not activated. They're just activated manually. And then there is like pictures of you guys, all of you, even uh, of uh, Midnight uh, and um, Samir, Solomon, uh, Redden. All the people that uh, has worked with you have been connected to you. They are marked. And then there is like in the middle, there is Volo and Martino Sanchire, Grandpa, Grandpa Sanchire, next to each other. And around, there is like a picture of a passiflora around them. Mm. Guys, I think someone is watching us. Mm. Oh. Uh... What is yeah, about? actually, uh, she told me something not very specific, but uh, she said that that was a monster. But uh, it looks more like she has a crash on me or what? <laughs> you um, find your, the rest of, the, of your armor. It's lying on the ground, Volo. Loot time. Okay, now you have your armor piece back again. Okay. It's like all 
it's like this room is all about us. Like the map, the photos, the information, everything is about us. So someone is trying to... Okay, what are you guys gonna do? Um, yeah, I want to tell you, the... if, if she was after me and my grandpa, uh, maybe she is now going for my grandpa. And he was like, that's a possibility. This means that we have to make sure she doesn't get you. Doggy was like, we're going to protect you. Oof. Regardless, she got Eli. We should save her, right? Yep. And what were you uh, saying, Red Rose? Yeah, I see a computer on the left. So maybe I could hack him to see if there is any data we could use. Maybe yeah. to discover you what, see that where the she gets. The computer has the screen half broken, but you could still manage to use it. You have to yeah, give me so... a tinkering. Difficulty five. Okay, I have already three, and I'm gonna miss. No, four. Okay. Bang. Woo! You managed to control the PC, and uh, from the PC you steal some information about Millie having the location of the elusive one that got kidnapped recently by Alina. The elusive one? Yeah. Okay, guys, do you see what is the elusive one, maybe? Uh, yeah, of course. Okay, so that I get some, like, now some data. Can I show them some somehow, this data? Yeah, yeah, you can, uh, you can directly extrapolate it and show it, like, with uh, digital pictures all around the room if you want. Okay, so I do like that, so you can see all around you what it's all about. And you see, like, a lot of information about how the elusive one got kidnapped and then there is like a video of Alina assaulting the base of the elusive one and taking away somebody but you cannot identify their identity so it's true Alina did kidnap the elusive one and she's been working with Millie all along <laughs> interesting you notice something in uh, in Rio. The, his voice is like deeper than usual, and he looks like uh, more detached than usual. Are you feeling right, Rio? Yeah, it's just been. I had a lot lately. Oh. Well, you know that we we were a team, but. I think we we still team. If you need something from us, you know you can come. Us. Rio, it is like, yeah, yeah, I know. I will. If I need something from you, I will take it. I promise. I will ask. Okay. And then it's like, why are you looking at me? Let's let's go find Eli. Do you, does anybody has an idea on how to find uh, her? Or there's some. Uh, is there any uh, camera or something like in the building? That mm, you any... could uh, you could try to uh, do some kind of doctrine or awareness to see where she went. Okay. I'm not the best at it, as I have one in all of them, maybe somebody else. Uh, I kind of you that it, too. Okay, I will like check the cameras. Okay, you check the cameras. The cameras have like uh, video feeds and uh, they're like uh, uh, there is a video of, of Nicole looking at you and it's like, Did you all hack my camera? Are you stupid? Do you think I would not counteract my cameras? I am smart, you know. So, goodbye, ciao. <laughs> <laughs>
Mm-hmm. <laughs>